I finally found the perfect way for us to communicate with Clang. We're going to borrow one of Earth's satellites. <laughs> this is so exciting. I have so much to tell my friends back home. Like, um, when we, uh... Oh, yeah, yeah, no, no. Um, that... You know that thing? No, I... To access the satellite, we'll use my revolutionary new launch system. The Fizz Blaster! Suck it! <sighs> Why is it always me getting blasted out of these things? Don't worry one bit. Daisy will be navigating you the entire way from right here, controlling your every move in the cold loneliness that is space. Okay, Robin, it's launch time! Man, I love hitting red buttons! I don't want to be on this ride anymore! This isn't so bad. Very quiet. Oh, I can't wait to get out of this chafing suit and into my comfy pants. <laughs> oh. Sorry. <laughs> okay, I've made contact. Here's what you do. There's a control panel located on top of the satellite. Gently open it and tell me what you see. Ah! I think we have an invasion on our hands. This is a job for our top, top secret spies. Earl, honey, you've been monitoring that supposed spy network for hours. Don't you think it's time to put it away? No, Mom. Who knows when I'm going to catch some government transmission about aliens? It could come at any time. <laughs> That's great, sweetie. But maybe you would be happier with a more, um, normal hobby? This isn't a hobby, Mom! There are aliens! Oh, you just don't understand! I just don't want you wasting your time searching for things that don't exist! <laughs> we'll talk about this later. And on a completely unrelated note, we have to go to the store! Yeah! We'll be back soon. Hmm, an alien invasion, eh? We better look into this. Let's go! Okay, now delicately touch the... Whoops. Ah! He probably could have been a little more delicate there. He's falling right towards the school! We have to catch him! Uh, can we wait a couple of minutes? I have a science test on Monday. And you know, would it really be so... I intercepted a message about an alien invasion! There was even a picture with the message. This is the evil alien we're dealing with. The government has sent out their top super spies to hunt the aliens, but we are going to find them first! Come on, let's go! Top secret super spies? This is not looking good! We have to get rid of any evidence from this satellite mission that could lead those spies to the treehouse! Let's go! This really isn't working for me. Much better. Good thing it's Sunday and no one was here. Thanks. <laughs> it was a rough landing. Something tells me this crater is a big clue that we should clean up before the super spies get here. Oh, oh, oh. I'll take care of this one. <laughs> oh, nice work, Sam. Except there might be one little problem. Hmm. Okay, this area is cleared of evidence. Where to next? Well, remember the giant launch bottle, the Fizz Blaster? I made it at the recycling plant. There might be some leftover evidence there. Perfect! My wheel got a little scuffed up on re-entry. Maybe I can find a replacement there. <laughs> I'll have to do... The General told us the UFO landed around here, but I don't see a hole anywhere. Maybe the radar was off. Interesting. There are traces of metal with high levels of cosmic radiation in this sand. An alien must have landed near here. And it's probably pretty dirty. Looks like whoever or whatever is giving off this signal left and was traveling this way. Let's follow it to the north. Looks like we're the first ones here. I knew we could beat those super spies. General, we're following a lead. Yeah, it's leading us north. Okay, we get it. 
All right. You heard those oddly familiar voices. Let's head north. We're gonna find those aliens and show my boring parents. <clears throat> uh, you know, they really should fill this sandbox with sand or something. Okay. I zapped a bunch of ordinary bottles to giant size to test them out for the launcher. They should be around here somewhere. Yeah, not that hard to find, Rivet. So beautiful! Able to hold so much soda! Now, to erase any evidence of us being here. And that takes care of that. Alright, let's get our stuff and get out of here! Hmm, recycling plant. Nothing here but some normal-sized bottles. <gasps> Wait a second. I'm picking something up again. It's detected a metallic alien life form moving away from the factory. To the... wherever we're going. Here, Stan. <laughs> Come on, Larry. We must have almost caught up by now. Just a few more steps and... <sighs> I'm thinking that those are the spies on our tail. Normal people don't usually have jetpacks. Really? What a backwards world you live on. Yeah? Well, I'm thinking we should probably... Sewer, right? Ew. I think we lost those super spies. See, that's the difference between them being super spies and just being plain old spies. They take a lot longer to lose. Whatever, Robin. I'm just glad we got rid of them and cleaned up all the evidence so they have no way to track you guys down. <sighs> yeah, about that. Uh, remember when we were all like running and sliding and stuff? Good times. Well, and you're going to laugh at this. I seem to have lost my backpack in the sewer with my name and address on it. Spies won't be able to put that together, right? Spies? No. Super spies? Yes. I don't want to be examined for the next hundred years. <laughs> my parts will get all rusted. Yeah, I'll just self-destruct, so no biggie. Actually, guys, I think I have a plan. Stop right there, you alien fiend! And hand those kids! Your days of running around and doing alien things are over! You're coming with us! Oh, hey, strange people in black masks that we don't know are spies that have been following us! Do you guys know anything about robotics? See, we built this robot for our science project, but we just can't get it to work! Bee boo boop! Boop squirt tweet tweet! We just can't get it right! If this is just a science project, then how did a deep space satellite take pictures of it in space? Yeah. Uh, um, well, uh, uh, we, uh, uh, we, uh, uh, uh... We were just wondering why there's a picture of a dog's mouth coming from our satellite. Ah, uh, false alarm. The satellite must have malfunctioned and crashed here. Case closed. Yes. That'll explain everything. You know, you guys are doing a bang-up job. Keep up the good work. See ya! Well, that was a close one. No more hijacking spy satellites. Yeah. Does my head really look like that? I intercepted this message about aliens, and there were super spies, and I fell in a sandbox, and then I found this. Um, hmm. Th th that looks just like a, a, a normal baby's toy. <laughs> yeah, something like that. 
I don't think so, Dad. I'm pretty sure one of the super spies we were following dropped it. I told you to put it back in your pocket. I just can't get it to work. It has this thumbprint unlocking mechanism. Only the thumb of the owner can open it. <laughs> and I don't see any super spy thumbs around here. <gasps> I can't believe it. Uh, we can explain. Uh, yeah. You see, a long time ago... A very long time ago... The government... You were right, Dad. Well, it must be some kind of baby's toy. Wow, they sure make them complicated these days. I wonder why my thumb couldn't open it. Uh, probably just broken or something. Looks pretty cheap. Oh, well, what's for dinner? You guys do anything exciting today? <laughs> <laughs> you know... Not much. <laughs> Not much. <laughs>